This is a race against death. A lonely race. This is my grandma, Dr. Chin Shi Sheng. In 1950, she was admitted to medical school of Peking University. After graduation, my grandma went to Inner Mongolia in a response to the call of the Communist Party of China to assist the country's frontier areas. Life in Inner Mongolia was very hard at the time. Most of the local women delivered babies at home. There was no disinfection equipment, no midwife, and no obstetrician. Grandma stayed in Inner Mongolia for 30 straight years. When she retired, the local maternal mortality rate had dropped to 1 17th of the figure of the 1950s. For her contributions, Grandma was granted the country's highest award in gynecology and obstetrics. Outstanding gynecologists and obstetricians, Lian Zhao Jie Kup. The child Grandma holding in her arms is my mom, Liao Jingbing, who grew up in Inner Mongolia. Mom often says that she was more familiar with Grandma's back than her face. Despite Mom's complaints about Grandma's never-ending busyness, she chose to study in the same medical school where Grandma graduated and became a busy obstetrician and gynecologist herself. She joined the Communist Party of China as well. While doing her internship in a hospital, Mom met an orphan couple who grew up together. The young woman's malignant tumor was incurable. Mom witnessed the young woman's dreadful suffering and death. After that, she made up her mind to conquer malignant gynecological tumors in patients. Following Grandma's steps, she also volunteered to work in a medical team in a remote area. For the impoverished women in the border area, Mom was not only a doctor, but also a sister, a nanny, and even an accountant who helped them save money. Like Grandma, Mom was also granted the highest national award in gynecology and obstetrics for her contributions to the treatment of gynecological tumors. The two top awards have always been inspiring to me. My name is Lui Tao. I had this photo taken when I was working in Xizhang. In 2001, I was enrolled by Peking University Health Science Center and became an alumna of Grandma and Mom. I am also an obstetrician and gynecologist. My focus of research is on common problems affecting women's lives, like urinary incontinence. Following the path grandma and mom took decades ago, I've also volunteered to work in a remote area, Xizhong Autonomous Region. Probably few people know that for Tibetan herders, visiting a doctor means a migration of the entire family. 
Fortunately, a high-altitude ecological relocation policy was launched. Even the poorest Tibetans were covered by the basic medical insurance system. In the 1950s, as a CPC member, Grandma strived to save the lives of pregnant women and their babies in the border area. In the 1990s, as a CPC member, Mom strived to save the lives of patients with malignant gynecological tumors with meticulous research. In the 2020s, I'm working hard to help Chinese women live better 